Hi everybody and welcome to the Cheapytronics YouTube channel. I'm Allison Cope and today we're going to be making a light up cityscape card. I've already started today's card front including cutting out the back side of the windows. I'm going to create a stamped panel in which to create our circuit today. So I've taken the images straight from the front of my card and positioned them on my card base. So we're going to locate all three of our light stickers today, including two in our windows and one in the lamp. I'm using our craft stencil to prepare that. Next, we're going to be adding our battery card. It's a self-adhesive, so just peel off that sticker. We are going to start by mapping out the negative side of our circuit. I'm just using the edge of our craft stencil because it's easy. The negative side of our circuit needs to touch the pointy part of our stickers today. So I'm connecting all three of those points together. Next, we're going to map out the positive side of our circuit, which comes off the flap of our battery holder. We're going to continue that up and across all three of the fatter parts of our stickers. And that completes our circuit today. We are going to put a yellow LED light sticker on first underneath that little lamp. It's just a peel and stick. And next we're going to use our LED white fade, which is heart shaped. We're going to also place that on one of the windows. And we're also going to use our LED white blink sticker, which is a gem shaped. And we're going to position that over our second window. Now that our stickers are down, we can apply our conductive fabric tape. And this tape is adhesive. You just peel off the backer and it is bendable. So you just bend it around all of those corners and to also trap the second part of our negative line of circuit, you can cut and patch. We're going to start the positive side of our circuit on the inside of our battery holder. And you're just going to go to the outside of the flap and then continue on down the remainder of the red lines and over each end of those stickers. And we need to trap those other two stickers just make sure that you don't cross your positive and negative lines. We're going to put our foam battery holder within the confines of our switch. We're going to place in our battery and give her a test. And there she is. To finish off our card, we need to put our three-dimensional foam on around our circuit. And this just helps hold up the card front. And let's give our switch a press. And there's our card for today. Thanks for joining me and make sure that you hit the subscribes and we'll see you again soon.